Hi, welcome to EIC 2008. My name is Felix Gaitkins. I'm senior analyst for Kuppinger and Kohl. And I have with me Volker Schmidt, who is the president of EMEA for Novell. Mr. Schmidt, uh, Novell has been uh, active in quite a few segments. You've uh, bought SUSE, so you're in Linux as well. So how strategic is identity management actually for you? Well, Felix, that's an excellent question. And I think this goes way back to the uh, to the roots of Novell, what we've built years ago when we kind of invented the directory. It was always part of our core business. It still is part of our core business and we've just extended what we started to build way back in the early 90s. Today, identity and access management is about 20 to 25% of our revenue and it grows at a pace of 20 to 30% depending on the geography we are active in. So it's a very significant part of our business and it grows at a very significant rate. Well, uh, a lot of your competitors, they've been buying companies left, right and center to very quickly build a comprehensive suite. Some of them might arguably have had some more problems uh, digesting all of the acquisitions that they've made. Now, you as a, an old network company, you might already have had um, products that have been more integrated uh, than others. So what is uh, your strategy in them? That is one of the advantages I believe we have as a company acting on and behalf of our customers. Um, in identity and access management, given the fact that it's security and tightly connected to governance and compliance, you need to have an integrated stack of applications. If you just acquire companies and then put the burden of integration back to the customer, that normally leads not to an integrated access and identity management. And the last part of it is you even have to integrate other parts such as event management into it in order to have a full set of support tools for governance and compliance. Can you talk a little bit about event management? Um, some of our viewers might not necessarily be uh, so up to par with what that actually entails. Yeah, that's a good point. So event management, if I translate that into a scenario that happens every day at a customer side, is use an example, right? So there's an administrator and a user of a system. And the user of a system wants to have additional access to other systems. So there are several ways to achieve access to systems, right? You can go the official way, following the workflow, and maybe your access is denied. But then you may have a friend that works in the IT administration. So you bypass your official system and you tell your friend, can you just grant me the access to those systems? What event management does is it catches the event. So even if the IT administrator would grant access to a system, which conflicts segregation of duty for an, as an example, immediately event management would kick in and would shut the entire account down, whether you follow the, the official workflow or whether you bypass the system. And event management constantly, real-time, monitors the compliance regulations that you have set in place and acts upon it. What about your approach to identity management? Some of those uh, projects, at least historically, have been not just hairy, but uh, have shown big overruns in cost and, and time, so you must have gained a lot of experience from that. So, what is your approach? Is there anything that you do differently than the others? In a best case scenario, we would advise any customer to have a comprehensive and integrated project team that works on an identity and access management project. This should not be seen as an IT project. This should be seen as an integration between the security officer it should be seen as an office of business objectives that are tightly integrated into what the IT can provide in order to help and to support identity and access management. We sometimes confuse, well, identity and access management is something IT has to do. No, IT is just a service provider for a business interest and objective that is far outside the IT in this case. So the integration within the customer is key for any success in any project we ever work on. Thanks a lot, Volker. It's great talking to you and have a successful conference and a lot of leads. Felix, thanks for all the questions. Sure. Great success, thanks.